Back here at Hawkins Arena where Mercer is victorious over Chattanooga 69-52. Bryce Coon alongside assistant coach Ben Weirs. But coach, it's been 20 days, a long time coming. How does it finally be able to play someone else first in another color jersey? Yeah, it's been nice. It's been a, it's been a long 20 days. Um, our girls have worked hard, though. They've stayed focused. Uh, I think we started out really strong. I think our defense was good. I think that you could see kind of a little bit of a lull there we had, and, and then we got things going there at the end. Um, but it's been a long 20 days, but it's happy to be back on the court and, and playing basketball again. There's a lot of players you can point to in this game. I think it was five and double figures, something like that. But Shannon Titus, another record broken for her. What has she meant to this program? Steals, I mean, she kind of does it all. Yeah, I mean, you know, you can put on the other team's best player, and you know you don't have to worry about her the rest of the game. And, and if somebody else is going, we can, we can move people around. But... Uh, she got going early. She got some steals. She had some layups early on that, that set the tone early. Um, and like you said, we had five people in double figures. It was different people at different times that, that got going. And, and uh, But Shannon's defense is really, really good. One of those players in a key time we were talking about in the broadcast was Aaron Howe. I mean, there was it was a close game, and you needed someone to kind of provide a spark after a scoring lull. Yep. She introduced herself to SoCon with a couple big three-pointers. What's it like having that kind of weapon? Yeah, she just stretches the court, and, and, and we, we were having a tough time scoring, and, and I think she came in and hit two or three threes real quick, and, and as you could see later on, they stayed tight with her and it helped, helped everybody else be able to get to the rim and shoot layups. And, and like I said, they, you had Shannon get hot early. You had Nigeria Harkless score at the end of the second quarter. Then you had Haupt hit her threes, and then Jaron goes off in the fourth quarter. So it's nice when you got four or five different players that can all step up and score and, and score in different ways, and it changes the game for us. Coach, going forward right here, I mean, you want to say we're going to play every single game left in the schedule. It's kind of weird. What's the feeling now? You got one under your belt here in SoCon play. What, what do you need to do going forward to be successful? We just got to appreciate every opportunity. And, and, you know, we told the girls that, we got to go out here every game and make it your most because you don't never know what's going to happen the next day or what's going to happen. So we just got to come out and be focused and play with everything you have because you don't know what's going to happen the next day. Assistant Coach Ben Weirs, but this has been Bryce Kuhn. So long from Hawkins Arena where Mercer wins the SoCon opener over Chattanooga. We'll see you next time.